We begin with breaking news out of Japan. A Japan Airlines passenger plane burst into flames at Tokyo's Haneda Airport. The airline says that everyone on board was safely evacuated before the plane was engulfed in fire. Joining me now for more on this from Japan is CBS News foreign correspondent Lucy Kraft. So, Lucy, what more are we learning here about this incident and what might have caused it? Good morning. Japan Airlines Flight 516, arriving from Shin Chitose Airport in Hokkaido, was about to land at Tokyo's Haneda Airport when it collided with a Coast Guard cargo plane and caught fire. Horrified witnesses watching from the terminal would describe a sea of flames. All of the 367 passengers, including eight children and 12 crew members, managed to escape before the Airbus A350 quickly disintegrated. State broadcaster NHK, quoting emergency services, said at least 17 of those aboard were injured without offering details. The Coast Guard crew did not fare as well. Police said five crew members are dead, and only the pilot with unspecified injuries survived. The plane was carrying badly needed supplies for earthquake victims in central Japan. This was truly a tragedy upon tragedy. All right, Lucy, um, very, very difficult details. Appreciate it. Thank you. And a desperate search for survivors is underway following a series of powerful earthquakes Lucy just mentioned in western Japan. At least 48 people have been killed and 17 seriously injured, according to officials. Aftershocks continue to shake Ishikawa Prefecture nearby areas just one day after a magnitude 7.6 tremor shook the area on New Year's Day. According to Japanese media, tens of thousands of homes were destroyed and water, power and cell services are still down in some areas. Japan's prime minister said the military had dispatched a thousand soldiers to the disaster zone to join rescue efforts.